I don't need caffeine. I don't need protein. I don't need creatine. I don't need steroids. I don't need trinibolin. I don't need TRT. I don't need meat. You just, if it ain't raw, bro, you don't know what you're getting. And you wonder why you got uh, inflammation in your neck out here. And then people be like, I only eat once a day. Yeah, but what you eating at once a day, that's why you bloated and puffy. You got here with Dro. Off all fruit, man. Yes, I could memo down how I ate yesterday, but I said I'm gonna, every time I eat something today, I'm gonna film it. But I, I gotta, I need to put it in what I ate all day yesterday. See how many calories it was? Yep. Oh man, getting strong with that fruit. Fruitarians, I summons you. I don't need caffeine. I don't need protein. I don't need creatine. I don't need steroids. I don't need trinibolin. I don't need TRT. I don't need meat. <laughs> I don't need pre-workout. <laughs> All I need is God and fruit. Hey. I don't need pre-workout. I don't need protein powders. I don't need TRT. I don't need trinibolin, anabol, testosterone, sipionate, and nanthate. I don't need HGH. I don't need IG, uh, IGF. I don't need TRT peptide, uh, Mac, Jack peptides. <laughs> I don't need man-made potters. I don't need salt. I don't need uh, liver king uh, carnivore diets. I don't need Joe Rogan carnivore diet. Hey! I don't need none of your synthetic when I grew up, it was like you was a if you use machines. Okay. That's like you go to my old uh, videos where I'm doing Smith machine. Yeah. People talking like newbies. Oh, um, Smith machine for and all that. But I'm the biggest motherfucker on the internet. You know what I mean? Yeah, right. Like, I didn't get it until I got into competing in bodybuilding. I had a few guys that was like my mentor, older than me in the sport. And they're like, bro, you ain't got to do all this shit. these machines. Go high reps and feel your muscles and all that ego lifting just go ruin you. With everybody that ego lift, they get ruined. Oh, yeah, I'm going lightweight today, baby. Lightweight, baby. Oh, yeah, this one feel better. Uh, now I'm going to do short ones. Get the pump, concentrate on the muscle. Flies, boy. Stretch it out like an eagle. Bah. Bah. Ah. Get up to a good 200 again. Clean, raw, shredded muscle. On nature's food, God's food. Mm. 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 Ah. Now, I got a, it's crazy how big I'm growing now that I'm not a bodybuilder. Like now that I'm in the health and wellness, my reach has 
grew even more so than I ever thought. So more of the world is into health and wellness and being fit and longevity. The bodybuilding that's just a small fraction of a genre that's not even realistic to real humans. <laughs> like, you know, most people I've come to find out look at that as suicide. As suicidal tendencies being a competitive bodybuilder. And I understand. I I'm grateful because I've been on both sides of everything. You know, I was a good kid, then a bad kid. I was anti-drugs and I tried them. You know what I mean? I was a foodie, now I hate food, which I hated food when I was a kid, then I became a foodie, now I hate food again. So it just, uh, I've been on both sides, man, of everything, man. I don't want to say unfortunate gift, but fortunate gift I've had in life to be able to relate to any and everybody. Do you want to blow up your social media? Are you tired of getting low views, no subscribers, no followers? I'm gonna put your video on my platform so you get the mass amount of subscribers, followers, views. Yes, I'm gonna do that. And I'm not only gonna do that, every Sunday we're gonna have a masterclass where I teach you in real time everything I learned and everything I know about social media. Sign up today, KaliMuscle.com, and I'll help change your life, guaranteed. Couple of them organic pineapples. Both of them grown at the same spot though. They look the same, probably is the same. <laughs> did notice drinking that pineapple juice did something to my stomach yesterday. It just disrupted it. So Dr. Sebi was probably right about that pineapple. Stay away from it is what Dr. Sebi said. What, was that the water I seen? I seen somebody posted a, another water I hadn't saw. Cause this got, stuff in it, I believe. Silica. Well, that's natural occurring. They don't tell you about the sodium in this, but he got it. Spring water with added carbonation. Oh, we done it. If they added that, there ain't no telling what else they add. Spring, Castle Rock. Bro, I need my f***ing old man glasses to see this <laughs> They do that on purpose. They want $4 for this, man. Five dollars. Man, I know that guy. You think they got sodium in it? Naturally occurring? Ain't no naturally occurring in water. These idiots think it's naturally occurring sodium in water. Uh, let's see, Castle Rock water. Do Castle Rock water have sodium in it? No, it don't have sodium. But that's a good one. Not, oh, but it got carbon dioxide. Why did it have that? CO2. I thought this was naturally, oh, it is carbonated. Oh yeah, we don't want that. We gotta pump chemicals in it to do that. I don't want that, boy. Hopefully I don't get no over, you know, how they, oh, if you eat only beets, you're gonna get too much of this. <laughs> too much of that. Beets healthy than a mug. So I got my beet juice at the house. So let's see, we gonna see. I'm gonna weigh everything today. I never did this in my life, believe it or not. Even when I was competing in bodybuilding, never weighed my food. So that's point six one. So we gotta see how many calories, nutrients that is, and I got a cup of beet. So let's ask. Hey Siri, what's the nutritional facts on point six five beets? Oh, he got protein in it. 58 calories, 2.2 .2 grams of protein, 13 grams of carbs. Beets are an extra source of vitamin C, fiber, potassium. You got sodium in it, 106 milligrams. I didn't know, I didn't realize beets had sodium. Naturally occurring, that is. Fiber, 3 grams, sugar, 9.2, 2 grams. That's where I'm getting my protein. Potassium. Ooh, look at that. I'm getting everything in the beets. But I know with that potassium, it's going to be the same as cucumbers. You could get hyperkemia mm. if you intake too much. Mm. It's good when you have an egg. Mm. What a beatful day. So, yeah, that's this one. Uh, 
do you think we could do some writing on the sleeves? So we doing the usual, you know, the one that we do on the side. Okay. One on the side, one on the pants, leg, on the same side. Because we normally do the logo on the opposite side. So do you want to do that? Yeah. Okay, mm -hmm. so just opposite side. Cool. Yeah, and the same side as the pants. What you got here? Oh, it's beets, man. You ever tried these? Beet chips? No. I need your young eyes, man. What beets. You? Beet chips with sea salt. And what does it say? Chips, hold on. Beet chips, non-hydrogenated canola oil. Oh, and God. Oil. Oh. You just... If it ain't raw, bro, you don't know what you're getting. It's just... It is what it is. If you ain't eating raw, you in trouble, man. And then now, they don't even have to put certain ingredients in it. So, it could probably got more than that. And you wonder why you got uh, inflammation in your neck out here and puffy. I just eat, uh... Then people would be like, I only eat once a day. Yeah, but what you eating that once a day, that's why you blow it in and puffy. And inflamed and holding water all around your body. <laughs> Gold source high iron kernels, raw. Why are these a dollar more? I wonder. Well, you know something good about them. They so expensive. They cashews expensive, more expensive than that. Walnuts, God damn. Guess uh, should I get the better one? Oh, they got to, they be paying for that. You are the organic. That's the difference. Get a couple of packs. Uh, dates. I let the date man pick out the dates. It's going down. They de seeding everything. When the last time y'all seen that? Seedless lemons. <laughs> yeah, that's what you bought. <laughs> I don't like seeds. Okay, we'll GMO them for you. Bottoms up, another cup of beet juice. Mm. Tell me if you guys uh, drink beet juice. Got my beets, same amount as last time, but this time I got a cup of apple juice. I don't want no more beet juice. Ain't no calories. This is only like 58 calories. Cup of apple juice. Hold on, let me see a couple. Hey Siri. How many calories is a cup of apple juice? It's apple only 46 juice calories. 46 calories. I'd be lucky to crack 500 calories a day. So I think I'm gonna have a couple of dates. So I add in three dates to give me a date. Show them on camera how to eat a date. Oh, they cold too. So I bust that seed out like that. Pow. See that? Pow. Mmm. You don't need candy when you got a date. We all go throw away them Skittles and all, all that poison, y'all. You can go get some better than any candy out there, man. What up with it, guys? So last meal of the night, um, you go have an apple. So today, uh, I had beet, which I showed you guys. Uh, 0.6, I had them twice. Three cups of beet juice, a cup of apple juice, had about eight dates, a handful of pumpkin seeds, and this. So we go add up the calories. I think I got, because uh, just two, three dates are 200 calories. So I got it close to a thousand calories maybe today. So I'm gonna add it all up for this video. So, uh, I'm gonna do this. I'm gonna put a little honey on it just to trick my mind into thinking it's caramel. <laughs> uh, I thought the other day I had some good caramel. Come to find out it had crap on it. So, this is uh, some honey from Farmer's Market. So, I'm just do that. I got this cup of apple juice or two cups of apple juice. Gotta make sure I memo this down for tomorrow. For miles, so hey, 
We'll see how much we weigh in the morning, man. So this is, well, let me bless all my food. Thank you, God, for the food I ate. Bless it. Give us sustenance for our bodies. Health and wealth success. Let me live to be 300. Uh, we ask that you give us all the wealth that we need to suffice. Thank you. Thank you for my family, my wife, my kids, and my uh, uh, in-laws, my brother-in-law. Amen. Good. Good night, everybody. It's 8.30. Time for me to go to bed.